Hey there, welcome to another tutorial. In this tutorial, we'll be going over the ball socket. Now, a ball socket is a, allows you to create a ball socket joint between two props, as you can see. And this will allow the props to rotate at a fixed distance from where you weld, or sorry, where you set the ball socket. Now, ball socket is quite useful. Not only can it be used as a ball socket joint, but if you're clever with it, you can turn it into a hinge. So if I have two props like so, now where where you where you select on the prop to place the ball socket makes a difference. If I place it like that, as you can see, it's based around that point. Now if we do two ball sockets together, like so, it actually creates like a hinge. So you can use that as like a door or something. Now there's obviously no collide, it, which is I'm sure there's uses for no collide, but if you have the no collide set up and you have these two props like so, so ball socket, basically this just lets them pass through each other. The force limit is pretty self-explanatory. If you want the if you want the joint to be unbreakable, you leave the force limit at zero. But if you want to make it breakable, you simply select the value you want and we'll use the tool. And if I put enough force in it, it should break like so. Thanks for watching and I hope you enjoyed this tutorial.